Hello, welcome to the Blogify training series. In this video, I will show you that how you can add a website to Blogify. To add a website, first, you have to click on Manage Websites and then on the Website List option. As you click, a page with a website listing table will appear. Inside this table, all your previously created websites will be displayed. Now to add a new website. Click on Add Website button. Now a form with various options will appear. The first field is of website type. There are three options supported. The first option is the website name. Using this option, you will be able to create a subdomain of blogify.org.in. This option does not need any external website hosting as well as any extra configuration like the other two options. The second option is a custom domain name. Here you can use your custom domain name for your website. You will be provided with the deployment package that you have to deploy on your web hosting to get your website live. The third option is WordPress. If you already have a WordPress blog or website you can directly include the Blogify content into your website using the WordPress plugin provided. The next field is Website Name. Inside this field you have to provide a domain name. Next, you have to select the template. There are five templates supported. You can preview the template by click on the preview link below the field. The next option is a website logo. This image will be used as a logo for your website. The next options are for providing information like contact email and short about content that will be displayed on the footer of the website. Inside the website footer settings section, you can provide information like your social network profiles, opt-in form code for newsletter function, Facebook comments section, live chat code, website metadata text, and favicon. Once you provide all the information, simply click on the Save Website button. Now your website is created and you will be redirected to the Manage Website List page. In the next video, I will explain how you can add content to your newly created website.